71% of some 1,000 people said that artists were not essential. To those people, I would say... Hey, it's Asher here. In the Sunday Times, it mentioned that the number one non-essential job was being an artist. Now, perhaps we've done such a good job of doing our job that you don't notice us. Because good design and good art is usually in the background, it's usually invisible. You can't actually see it happening. Bad design and bad art stands out like a sore thumb. Now let's see what happens when we take out the top 5 one by one. Number 5. Human Resource Manager. You don't like to receive money and to have a job? 4. Business Consultant. You don't like the business that you are working in to make more money so that you can continue to have a job? Number 3. Social media manager or PR specialist. Everybody is on social media these days and customer service is part of social media. Don't you want to be part of a company that looks good? Number two, telemarketer. Many people still prefer to talk on the phone and businesses will contact those people to sell them their product services and additional lobang. Do you want to do the job? Number one. Artist. Ah, my company doesn't hire artists. I'm not artist. No. Doesn't make sense, right? It's non essential. No, not really. Website development, brand colors, brand design, shop layout, packaging, all these are forms of art. It's very important to have business and money making. All this is how we sustain life. But art is how we enjoy life. Allow me to share some examples of art. Would you like to read this or watch this? How about reading this versus listening to this? If artists were not necessary, this is what you'll be seeing and hearing on TV and radio. Architecture is an art and science of designing buildings and physical structures. When you bring your date to a nice place with great music and nice ambience, you are surrounded by art. Maybe you refer to painting on canvas as artists, those who display their art in museums, etc. Painting lets us have a glimpse into human expression through time, into modern day context, and also into our inner being. Here in Singapore, unfortunately, we don't support our local artists in our local creative and artistic scene as much because we've been exposed to so many professionals from overseas, so much so that we think local staff cannot make it. And you know what? You're right. Because you've been exposed and fed with so much good stuff, you now have developed a taste for it. Back in the olden days when we had nothing to compare to, we have creative stuff like Sen Tiao Xia Li, Song Tian Zi Tun, we have Dragon Playgrounds, there's so many things that were being very creative. And because money, sponsorship, all this came into the equation, a lot of the creativity started to become a bit stifled. So we don't see as much creative productions as they used to be. So right now here in Singapore, we have a lot of budding artists, people who are coming out to try and do something. Now, if you are successful, you, you have a name, you are a celebrity, you are a star. But if you are not successful, wh whether that be it through exposure, through money, you are just a struggling artist. Now, a lot of good art has to come through bad art. And it takes a lot of bad art to create some good art and finally to create great art. Whether you like it or not, you are a constant consumer of art. But for those who insist that artists are non-essential, I would like to say that, you know, sometimes when you don't see something working, it doesn't mean that it's not, like a brain. So my fellow artists, let's not shoot the messenger that is Straits Times. It is simply a reflection of how society views us. But I would like to take this opportunity, perhaps, to use this as a stepping stone to showcase what we can do. You know, it'll be a good time right now to show everybody what you can do and to perhaps change someone's views on what is art. Wouldn't that be cool? Question for the day. 
With the advance of technology, do you think robots can replace artists? Let me know what you think in the comments below. With that said, please like, subscribe and share this video.